Check the readings, but that may have been our biggest quake yet. Standard procedure. Newhart, you know what to do. If there's any critical damage to the base, let me know. Yeah, okay, uh, no problem. Dr. Van Buren, you will assist me at the landing site for the Cyrano. Declan, you're on comms. Find any system issues, relay them to Shane. Aye, aye, Captain. Switch to a private frequency, Declan. No chatter on open channels. Over and out. Private channel time. Okay. Confirming my ID bypassed security for my room. Doors unlocked now. Well, the rest of the team's out dusting the landing pad, and Dr. Volkova's apparently deep into her biocultivation duties. So, I guess that means you have the base all to yourself. And where are you? Once more, I venture into the great unknown. On duty at the satellite dish. Currently the communicating, which hey, is technically what's up with the job. lights? Uh, yeah, getting some odd spikes in power as the batteries kick in. Hey, you, you just hang tight while I do your job for you, okay? You know, have a coffee. No, really, take, take a load off. Who put up this sticky note about the witch? <sighs> you like my drawing? I made it last night. Hmm, do I like poking fun at a shared paranoid delusion while everyone is tired and isolated from human contact on Mars? Okay, killer, remind me not to talk to you before you've had your coffee. Uh, can you check your bio gauge and see if your daily objectives have been updated? Copy that. Crap! Mm, what's up? I, uh, I seem to have misplaced my bio gauge. Josie saw it in the lab on her way out. Told me to tell you. Better get it before you do anything else. Speaking of which, that should do it. I fixed the lounge door to the lab.
so weird. Deja vu. There was a stuck door in the dream I had. It's not important. It's just weird. Uh, you're forgetting the last three times something malfunctioned in this over-engineered campsite. Now, where is that bio cage? No good. I think there's a reset button somewhere. Just my luck. I need to find something that can fit in there. Declan, I found the bio gauge, but it won't turn on. I need to reset it. Uh, find something small and thin. A pen should work. There. Got it working. Great. You should be able to reboot the security system now. Just scan the servers with the bio gauge. Quake probably knocked the panels out of alignment. This has been an ongoing issue. I'll have to adjust the solar panels manually. Declan, I am buckled in and headed to the solar panel array. Well, now you've got nothing to do but listen to me. Just when my migraine was starting to clear up. I'm actually glad to have the Sierra landing today. Some fresh faces, supplies, distractions. Everyone's so on edge lately. I don't know, maybe I'm just imagining it. These dreams are starting to get to me. Yeah, you're not the only one having strange dreams there, Ace. You too? Oh yeah. I mean, put yourself in my shoes. You log out after your shift, eat some rehydrated meatloaf, and lock down for the night. But the second you fall asleep, it feels like you're back at your desk and you hear the static again. Calibrate, more static, calibrate, then something sounds different, it's a pattern, you start decoding it, it's gibberish, but the static keeps talking. It wants you to hear the symbol. And uh, then I wake up and there's scribbled notes around me. Feels like I haven't slept in a while. All right, I showed you mine. Now lay it on me. Your dreams, nightmares, fantasies, your deepest, darkest fears. Let's hear it. Sorry, I just pulled up to the office. I'll have to get back to you on all that. Eh, suit yourself. The anticipation is killing me. Declan, I'm heading up to the perilous rocky pathway. Power cell for the elevator is missing. Have fun. Oh, hey, just got an update from Commander Wilcox. Landing site preparations are underway. Also, she told me to clean up my shit at the comms tower. <laughs> she didn't want to scare off the new recruits. I like Josie. The solar panels are definitely desynchronized. 
I'll have to connect with my bio gauge to rotate them. If I'm quick, there may still be enough hours of daylight to recharge the overnight batteries. Kinda glad to get out of the base. Walk around. Yeah, it's nice to step outside. Breathe in that non-existent Martian air. Well, there's that. But I can move out here. I don't know, spread my wings a bit. Like a beautiful dead Martian swan. Like a dead Martian eagle, thank you. saw someone. Don't see anyone now. Let's just get this done. Lucky I brought along a power cell. Hey Declan, why don't you give me your password? I'm just gonna check out your browsing history. Hard pass. Grab that cell powering the facility before I go. situation at the solar site. Panels are out of alignment again. Until the Cyrano gets here, I don't have the parts to test. Can't confirm the issue 100%. All right, just so you know, anything breaks around here and I've got four Orochi execs on my ass. You would explain to them why a multi-million dollar piece of equipment is being manually adjusted every day. Be my guest. But we have a mission and I'd rather focus on that, not fucking filling out paperwork. Copy? Copy. Not your fault, but after the Cyrano lands, no excuses. Get it done. Over and out. down. so that you can see when Phobos is passing overhead. It, it circles Mars three times a day, you know, and um, it, it, it is required that everyone downloads this program. Um, I've already added it to your OS to ensure that you, you don't forget. Uh, thanks? You're welcome. I think it'll really help with morale. Declan. The solar panels are now calibrated. Heading up the hill to the conduit. Uh-huh. Yeah, I mean, copy that. Looking good. Power.
be back on.